Hey everyone, what's going on? It's Vasim here from the channel Hands and Smiles. Welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be doing a first impressions of an oud oil. It's from the house of Immortal Oud, and this one is called Prince of Cambodia. So if you guys have been watching a lot of my videos in the past maybe year and a half or so, I've covered a few oils from the house of Immortal Oud. Uh, they're based out of Thailand and also have a distribution centre, I think, here in the UK. Uh, so, and they bring out a lot of affordable oils and mainly around the Thai oils and Thai oils and are mostly quite uh, sweet, fruity, quite easier to wear type of ouds. So let's give Prince of Cambodia a uh, first impressions. Going by the name, this is probably a Cambodian oil. I don't really have much information on this one. Uh, it's a new release and uh, going by my previous experiences with Cambodian oils, they tend to be quite sweet. Uh, some of them have a fruity element, I've, but I've also tried some Cambodies which are, are which lean a little bit funkier and have like a, a tobacco-y sort of smell. Uh, touching closely to some Hindi oils but then have an element of sweetness to it. So Prince of Cambodia, let's give this one a first impression. Hmm. This seems a lot darker than I would have imagined. Um, it's got a deep berry sort of feel. So it, there's berries, but it's very, very deep, and it doesn't come across like a bright Cambodian. It's like a deep, uh, dark berries. There's a sweetness, obviously, to the berries, but it's deep and quite dark. It doesn't come across too uh, bright. Uh, there's not like a fruit. It's not like a fruit punch. Um, on my uh, skin, it seems a little bit soft, so it's not projecting massively. There's a little bit of a fermentedness in here of the fruit, just a tiny, tiny bit. The colours that I get in my head are these deep red, ambery sort of colours. That's what's bringing out, and it feels like an evening sort of oud. Uh, some ouds, when you wear it, it feels like a hot, scorching afternoon, but this one seems like a, an evening just before the sun's going down. It's deep dark berries uh, with some sweetness and a little bit of funkiness uh, fermented fruits <sighs> but it seems a little bit gentle on my skin it doesn't project massively uh, I'll have to give it a full proper wearing to understand it's all its facets so 